which class did you start your preparation for WBJ? Uh, I started preparing from class 11. Class 11. So what 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 is your suggestion? This is the perfect class from where you should be serious for your examination, or or or, or also I, from earlier classes. Uh, I think it's pretty much okay to start preparing from class 11. Uh, but for in uh, 10th standard, I started um, covering a bit of the syllabus of class 11. Okay. So what was the key factor behind your success in WBJE examination? I think what helped me most was my speed because in WBJE, you have a large number of questions to solve and a limited amount of time. So speed is most important and uh, I develop my speed by uh, practicing regularly. So what is your view over the current pattern of WBJ and JE main? I think uh, the present pattern is helpful for students because uh, WBJ pattern is quite similar to JE advanced in some ways and JE mains. So that helps students to prepare for both competitive exams at the same time. Okay, great. So which books did you refer for your preparation? Uh, while preparing for WBJ, I mostly uh, practiced uh, previous year's papers. Okay, so this is something which is you, you told us about the application part that you have really practiced the previous year papers. But uh, can you please brief that which book you have studied for your WBJ examination or for the JE examination? Uh, basically, I used to attend uh, classes at Fiji, so I used to use the material for studying. In addition to that, I uh, used to practice Arihant and Tata McGraw books. Did you take the coaching for the uh, WBJ examination or what really you think that um, it is necessary to join the coaching classes for, 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 for getting a good rank in WBJ or JE examination? Uh, I don't think it's absolutely essential for students to join coaching. It uh, at the end depends on the students such that they can plan their uh, studies in one way. If they think that attending a coaching class helps them in covering the syllabus and getting the doubts clear to, in order to prepare well for the exam, then they can attend. But it's not an absolute necessity. Okay. So along with the study material, how much weightage you are giving for the mock test to the mock test? I think uh, mock tests and practice tests are pretty helpful as it uh, allows a student to understand how he or she is preparing for the exam and helps them to understand where their weaknesses are. So, the last but not the least, and for the for the student who are going to appear for the next year, I'm a next year aspirant. So, what tips would you like to give for the next year aspirants? Uh, I should tell them that. Uh, they should uh, put in uh, they should set their goals early and then uh, manage time properly while preparing for the exams plus uh, no one should uh, neglect any subject since uh, physics chemistry and maths are of equal similar importance yeah, so they yeah. should uh, cover the syllabus of each subject adequately and uh, can you list down your strategy what exactly your strategy was for preparing the wbj examination uh, my main strategy was that I would uh, cover each topic and then practice questions of that topic and then I would uh, regularly revise the each chapter so that uh, all the concepts were at my fingertips. Okay, what what was your rank in JE main examination or in the final IIT JE exam? My uh, rank in JE mains was uh, 50 and in uh, advanced it was 38. Oh great, again a big big congratulations bro. For more videos, log on to engineering section of jagranjosh.com.